Hey, what's up, guys? It's Kenny Hasbrook. I uh, just want to talk to you guys today about living arrangements uh, in Europe. Uh, I mean, this is my eighth season uh, professionally, seventh season here. I mean, I've pretty much seen all the living arrangements. And I just want to just go through my top five checklist, basically, and just say what's most important to me when I get here and uh, to have and maintain. Uh, first thing is when you get here is having Wi-Fi. Uh, I think it's extremely important uh, for American players especially to be able to have a strong Wi-Fi where you can surf the web, stream TV shows, download things, and um, just to be able to keep up like what was going on in America. So you can like because you want to FaceTime and Skype your family and friends. Uh, you stream TV shows. What's things going on in America, in U.S. and not really with their playing in Italy. Uh, so strong Wi-Fi is for me like the key factor. Like that's like the number one thing. Uh, second, I would say is the English TV. Uh, some, a lot of countries have it. Uh, usually like in Italy, they have Sky. And like for what I mean by this, you can switch it from Italian to English. And they have like TV shows from the States playing the whole time, usually on Fox. Uh, they have Modern Family, um, they got Bones, they have Power, Scandal, The Blacklist, they got a ton of stuff. Like they got it playing, it's just you gotta figure out the schedule of it, but they do play here. And if you have the right um, cable, you can switch it to English and have it. So those two, just to make like it easier as an entertainment in your home, like you don't have to sit there trying to kill your dad on your phone. Is, uh, those two things are very big to me. Uh, my third, for me at first, was bedroom, but I'm married now, and uh, my wife cooks a lot. She really throws down, for real. And so, right now, my third is ki my kitchen. Uh, we got to have a functional kitchen. Like, it doesn't have to be an amazing spread out kitchen with a, a island in the middle and stuff like this, but... It just has to be a working oven, a working stove, and enough space so she can move around uh, because she pretty much cooks every, I wanna say five out of seven days she cooks. And uh, so that's extremely important. Um, the team this year, we had a terrible oven. I mean, it was disgusting, man. And uh, luckily it's a, they're an honest program and an honest organization. And they told me they was gonna fix it. They fixed it in two days. And I have a brand new oven now. So now, family-wise, uh, the kitchen is number three. Uh, number four is the bedroom. Like, I don't need a big bedroom. Like, it doesn't matter when I'm over here. Like, I just want a queen-size bed that's comfortable. And if I have a queen-size bed that's comfortable, I'm good. Like, that's all I need. So I, I shouldn't even say the bedroom, just the bed. Like, just give me a good bed that I can sleep on. I go buy the pillows and the sheets if I need to, but I have a good bed. And uh, my number five is the living room. Uh, we got like I just gotta have a decent living room where I can sit and chill, like ice my knees after practice, hang out with my wife and talk, Facetime the family, whatever, watch movies. But gotta have a decent living room, just where you can hang out in and be comfortable. Like it doesn't have to be amazing, but just to be comfortable. And uh, those are my top five. Uh, like I said, I've been here I'm going on eight years pro, seven years here. And uh, those are my things where it just has to be done, like for me. And uh, so far, so good. All right, see you guys later.